Darren Turner here in Leders Alp, and I'm trying the Ski Mojo for the first time. Now, I've skied with people that use it, and I know a few instructors that swear by it. If you don't know what it is, it's basically a device that's going to help with muscle fatigue and sore knees. It attaches to the back of the ski boot, comes up, there's a hinge around the knee area, and then around the thigh, you have basically a spring. Very similar to the thing that holds the boot of your car up. Once you get up higher, there's a harness very similar to a climbing harness that goes under the bum and that supports you. Now, it's supposed to take away about 30% of the pressure on your legs. So if you do struggle with fatigue or sore knees, it's maybe the solution for your skiing. Now, don't take this the wrong way. Until I took my trousers off, a lot of people didn't know it was actually on my legs. So if you're worried about how it looks and whether it looks like there's a big device on your legs, if it's under your trousers, it's pretty much invisible. Now, who is this device for? Now, for me, the two obvious things are maybe Father Time's caught up with you and you want to keep skiing in the way that you're accustomed to. It may well help that. The other thing is, if you've had an injury, knee, leg, or something that's hindering your skiing, and it could help you overcome that. But don't just think it's just limited to that. I ski with so many people that wish they'd been in the gym more, ridden the bike more, they're not as fit as they want to be, and they maybe get halfway through the day, and to be honest, fatigue creeps in, and it starts hindering their enjoyment. So anybody who needs a little bit of a help can put it on, and it's gonna help them get through the day and ultimately enjoy their skiing more. And to be honest, you know, I'm sure after a few times using it, you'll get totally used to it and it'll just be another piece of your kit. Well, that was my first test of the Ski Mojo. Now, I'll be totally honest, I was quite skeptical at the beginning of the day and I was really worried that it was gonna get in the way of my movements and feel a bit clunky and robotic. But you know what, it didn't. And I love the fact that there's a button on there that you can turn it on and off. For me, it's a good thing. I can maybe ski for an hour, two hours without it switched on. And if I start to get tired, I can then engage the mojo and it's there for me. And if it makes skiing more fun, surely that is the goal. <laughs>